Pick your head up and walk around here like you won. You know, Angela's gonna have to, if she wants to do this as a career, realize that actors have to deal with rejection all the time. You gotta snap out of this, pal. Rejection's part of this business. If you can't handle it here, you're never gonna survive. You wanna make it to that final three? Guys, you gotta dig down deep. Please pull out all the stops for this week's Director's Challenge. Good luck. I throw my heart and soul into everything that I've been doing here, and yet I still cannot get my foot forward enough to have them say, Angela, you did the best for the week. Good job. I am wondering if I can keep up with this much emotional stress. I don't know that there's going to be this much frustration. I just think that if you have any self-doubt, you're in the wrong place. It's just finally catching up with me, and I'm f***ing having my nervous breakdown right now, but I'm not going to let it hinder my acting. But it's like under pressure. Who cares if we're good if we can't deliver it? You know, like a lot of good actresses have gone home. I definitely think that Angela falling apart is going to affect her in the next competition. It is getting damn brutal out there. So I was going to the kitchen, and I saw there was a note on the mirror, and I was like, oh boy, here we go. Guys! Is there something? No. Mirror, mirror, let me see a terrifying side of me. Oh, sh They're gonna f with us. I don't know about any of this business. Someone's gonna pop out and know it. Oh! You look at the voodoo head. Oh, this is fun. Maybe we have to use one of these toys for our scene. Kind of Just... like the eyeballs. I'd use that. <laughs> oh, the puppy. The poodle. Oh. <laughs> Kate sits at her vanity mirror. Her evil reflection stares back at her, disgusted. Kate looks at the bottle of pills, then back at the mirror. Evil Kate is gone, replaced by her own reflection. reflection. Tomorrow's director's challenge, I'm very excited about it because we have two parts. We play evil self and our good self. That's going to be quite fun. It's all us. You know, after this, there's going to be three people in this house. I know. I know that it'll be very, very hard for them to send you home because you are so well-liked. There's no reason to send me home. Not yet. No reason. Michelle is blinded by her own arrogance. She needs to be cut down a couple notches. It's going to really suck, you know, having two leading ladies in a row, but I think I can handle it. Yes, you are very tenacious. I do admire <laughs> that quality in you. It can only get you so far, though, Michelle. Or you know what else gets you far sometimes? What? Humbleness. Humility isn't working for Lindsay in the competition, so why would I want to jump on that bandwagon? Good luck with all this. I know you're going to need it. Stop being such a whiny bitch. Get even. Oh, the pills. I can't wait to beat everyone. The other girls are just peons that I can't wait to crush. I know that I'm going to get this role. I really, really don't want to lose to her. I feel pretty good going into the director's challenge. It didn't hurt to have the boost of confidence of winning the skills test. Good morning, guys. Welcome to your next director's challenge. This week has been all about carrying a scene on your own without a partner to fall back on. You'll be playing two sides of yourself, the good you and your evil alter ego. To do that, we'll be using the green screen right here. First, you'll deliver all the lines and reactions as the good you. Then, we're going to shoot you as your evil alter ego. From that, we'll create a composite of both pieces of footage so it looks like you're having a conversation with yourself in the mirror. I've always wanted a twin, so I guess this is really my time to shine. Lindsay, because you won the leg up, you get to choose whether you want to go first or last today. Oh, I'll go last. Good. Good. So get into makeup and wardrobe and get ready for a one-on-one -on -one with yourself. This is definitely the most important director's challenge thus far, so I'm going to have to bring it. I love playing bitchy roles. <laughs> Denidra. Hello. So I was up first, and I was kind of happy about it because I don't have to look at nobody. Everything's fresh in my mind, and I can just get it. Okay, let's do this. 
Truthfully, I've never done a scene with green screen. So I was excited. Like, this is stuff I've never worked with before. Like I said, every day here isn't something new for me. Action. You are such a loser. So what are you going to do about it? Or we can just sit here, like we always do. You want him back, don't you? Don't you? And cut. OK, 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 good, good. Your really good thing as an actress is that you do, you're totally believable. Just a little bit more dynamics okay. in the scene. My first take, I felt good about it, but some of James's notes to me were kind of confusing. When you look up, take that moment to see her there and to let it process, OK? After she goes, oh, I don't, um, I'm sorry, I'm such a loser. When you look up and see her, take the moment to see her. One more time. So what are you going to do about it? Your roommate stole your fiance. Get even. How? The pills. Invite her over to get her stuff. Offer her a drink. Crush them up and put them in her drink. When she's out, I'll tell you what to do next. Cut. I was watching Tanisha's performance and I was actually taken back. Usually, Tanidra is a very solid actress, very truthful and very real. And today, just wasn't her best work. I think we need something a little more physical to differentiate between good and evil. And if you feel like something's not working, take a step back and say your line again. I feel like I'm not doing a good job. I was frustrated. What can I do? I don't want to hurt anybody. Would you stop being such a whiny bitch? Get even. Oh, the pills. Invite her over, tell her to get her stuff. Offer her a drink. Crush them up and slip them in her drink. And cut. I don't think she's very happy with her performance. Her head is down. I think I was better as my vulnerable self than my evil self. I didn't hate it, but I know that I'm capable of better than what I did. Action. You're such a loser. Up the energy just a little bit at the beginning, right? And action. You are such a loser. So why don't you do something about it? Or we could just sit here and do nothing, which we always do. Cut. It's really working well. Michelle has star quality. That is a given. If she wins leading lady again? Oh, she won't. If my drive in this competition has to come from wanting to humble and annihilate her, and that's where it has to come from, because I really, really don't want to lose to her. Action. Quit being such a whiny bitch. Tell her. Quit being such a whiny bitch. Your roommate stole your fiance. You do want him back, don't you? Get even. How? The pills. Invite her over, tell her to come get her stuff. Offer her a drink. When she's out, I'll tell you what to do next. Good. Your choices are really strong. Thank you. I made really bold choices. I definitely did different things that the girls would have never even thought of. I really feel like, overall, I did a good job. I feel good. I definitely feel confident. James gave me a lot of shell. It's right. It's perfect. It's perfect. It'll be interesting to hear what they say, you know? Yeah. Such a loser. This is much different from uh, what the other challenges have been. That evil, sadistic side of me was going to be fine, but it's very difficult for me to show that I'm scared or that I'm vulnerable because I am so controlling of my emotions. You are such a loser. So why don't you do something about it? Or you could sit there and do nothing. What am I supposed to do? I, I don't want to hurt anyone. Cut. Okay, good. But I, I need to see what gets you to say you're such a loser. You just found out your fiance cheated on you. It's a pretty dark place. Okay. 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 All right. You are such a loser. Don't you want him back? I don't want to hurt anybody. Stand up for yourself. How? Okay. It's good. But? Well, we can make it better. Think about what your intention is, where you are emotionally, what's going on with you, and just let yourself feel that vulnerability, okay? Okay. Stand up for yourself. Get even. But what can I do? The evil stuff is working, 
but let us see a little more vulnerability. Action. But what am I supposed to do? The pills.